Good morning. Welcome to our December YouTube from Priory Community School. Uh, as you can see this morning, uh, we're joined by three excellent students from our academy. To my left here, we have Mr. Cates, who's in our year 10. We have Miss Phillips here, Kaylee, who's in our year 9. And on the end here, we have Mr. Langdon Curtis, who is our rugby captain from year 10. Obviously, this is our last YouTube before we break up for the Christmas break. We're breaking up at uh, 12.30 next Friday the 16th. As is normal at PCSA, we break a little bit early on the final day of this term and the final day in the summer. So, happy Christmas to everybody. Say happy Christmas to YouTube, Mr. Cates. Uh, happy Christmas, YouTube. <laughs> Say happy Christmas, Miss Phillips. Happy Christmas, YouTube. Curtis. Happy Christmas YouTube. Well done. Happy Christmas to all you YouTubers. Um, now today you can see around we have a fantastic, well while we've got these students here today we are really proud of these young people and we're proud of all our students but particularly uh, our year 10 rugby team and Kaylee. So we're going to start with Kaylee today. You may see this and we've sent this Christmas card out. This is the Christmas card from the school this year going out to all our friends across the uh, um, country in fact. And if you see it really closely, it's a picture of uh, Western Supermare and uh, the piers there and, and the, the wheel down on the beach. And that was designed by this young lady here, who's Kaylee. Didn't you? Yeah. She's very quiet, Kaylee. Uh, but she's a fantastic artist. And you may have also seen in the uh, Mercury, there was this spread in the Mercury this last week, and there's Kaylee's Christmas card. Because out of um, how many entries did they have? 750. 750. 750 entries for the, M the local MP, uh, Mr. Penrose's Christmas card competition. This young lady was the winner. Round of applause, boys. <laughs> and what, what do you get to do because you've won this? I get to visit the House of Parliament and visit my family. All right. Yeah. I'm a dad pleased with you. Happy? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So. We're pleased. She's the winner. She gets to visit the House of Parliament uh, over the next couple, of, and her cards going out all across the local authority and across the country, say to to people. Uh, so well done. And she's going to be. What's your ambitions to be when you leave school? Um, a famous artist or a graphic designer or something to do with art. Really? Yeah. Well, be a graphic designer, <laughs> something to do with art. So anyone out there on YouTube land, if you want to hire a clearly a brilliant young graphic designer. Kaylee Phillips, Year 9, Priory Community School and Academy Trust will be your person and well done. Thank you. You're a star. Well done. Okay, now these two young, young men here, <coughs> excuse me, they are also absolute uh, geniuses and stars in slightly different ways. I went to a conference last week about talking about children with talent. Clearly this young lady has fantastic talent. I can tell you Mr. Cates here has brilliant talent as well. So does Mr. Langdon. So do all these boys. Ben Abrahams, Jospin Buxton, Matthew Cates, Josh Caulfield, Tom Easterby, Matt Hazel, Jamie Hoare, Marshall Hanney, Jamie Huggins, Callum Kingscott, Curtis Langdon, Captain, <coughs> Jordan Lees, James Locker, Cameron Lee, uh, Kieran Manning, Byron Marriott, Alex Parslow, Kaylin Rowlands, Harry Rowlands, Chris Sage, Nathan Scott, Will Snedden Coombs, Jacob Swain, and Ethan Van Haren. Those are the boys who have recently, there they are, there they all are, who have recently beaten <coughs> Colston's yep. in Bristol Public School, yep. Queen Elizabeth Hospital School, Bristol yep. Public School, yep. private school. Yep. Public yeah, school. private school, and before that, we had to play lots of matches last year to get into what is called the Daily Mail Cup. Now, if you go on our website, you'll be able to see a video of our latest match, round five, round six of the Daily Mail Cup, where we unfortunately lost to Kingswood School in Bath, 24-0, didn't we? That's right. And what was your, why did we lose this match, Mr. Cates? Tell you two why we lost this match, in your opinion. Uh, um, well, in my opinion, we just didn't put away our chances that we had. And, uh, yeah, it's just happens, doesn't it? You have them games. You do have them games. And tell, what position do you play in? I play scrum half. And he's brilliant. You do all the scrum half passes and you 
pass off both hands? Yeah. yeah. Well, of course. <laughs> what a silly question, Mr. Carlos. Of course I'm passing. Now, Curtis is our hooker and our captain. So you're the, right in the middle of the front row. Do you know yeah. where the hooker is in rugby? Nope. Right. Three in the front row. The hooker is the one in the middle of the props. Right. Tell the people on YouTube about your rugby career and your ambitions and anything you want to say about being a hooker. What's the, what's the toughest bit about being a hooker? I don't really know. I just, just enjoy it. I want to, something I want to do in my later life. You play rugby? Yeah. Want to be a professional rugby player? Yeah. Who for? No, any for anyone really. Don't really mind. You want to play rugby professionally, Mr. James? Uh, yeah, for me it'd be be good if I could. Yeah. It doesn't happen. It doesn't happen. No, does it? no. What else would you like to do if it doesn't happen? Uh, possibly join forces. And join the forces. Not really sure. But. Okay. Ambition. Point is. Superb rugby player, superb rugby player, superb artist. All of these rugby players in this team, we have, we've got. I mean, I, I, I've never seen a team uh, be so technically gifted. Sometimes you have one or two big lads in the team, and they they win rugby matches. This particular rugby team with Mr. Biddle, who deserves a huge congratulations, very and sport at Priory, very uh, big and very important to us. They really have a great team, and we still hope, do we not, now, chaps, that we're going to win the. County Cup again. Yep. We've got to play Beaching Cliff at Bath, I believe, haven't we? Yep. And we're going to win that, aren't we? You do you wink at me then, Curtis? Give a little wink. <laughs> then he said, "Yeah, we're going to win that." So you're going to, we're going to win this. So congratulations, them. Round of applause, Kaylee. Me and you for these two. This rugby team. And Mr. Pang, up in there. And there's our trophy that we've won. So well done to them. Now, just before we finish today, <clears throat> I've mentioned when we finish, and we come back on Tuesday, the third of January which is uh, quite early for us to come back in early January, but it is Tuesday the 3rd. Um, we have big exams for Year 11. There's Mr Pound putting up those exam dates there. They come across the top. Thank you, Mr Pound. Those are the exam dates happening in January. Year 11 have full exams in English on the 10th of January. Uh, the exam timetable is on the website. They have full exams in RS, and they have science exams and an ICT exam, Mr Pounds. He's saying to me, he's mentioned the ICT, so they have an ICT exam. So we're really pleased that and hopeful that they will be fantastic exam results, uh, exams and indeed exam results because in, in January, many of our year 11s will get their exam results back from their uh, maths exam they took in November. And just for parents to be aware, our YouTube watchers, Curtis and Mr Cates here will Matt will both take their English and their maths exams at the end of this year, yeah? Yeah. 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 So we're all, not only are we good in the rugby field, we're good in the classroom, aren't we? And Kurt, you won an award, didn't you? The award, what award did you win, Kurt? I remember. Best start to GCSE maths. In year 10. Brilliant. Best start to GCSE maths. So we must be the probably, potentially the only school in the country with a hooker, rugby player, who is also the best mathematician, start GCSE mathematician. So well done, Curtis. Uh, not only a hooker in the front row of the scrum, but a brilliant mathematician as well. Are you a brilliant mathematician, Mr. Kate? Um, not particularly, But no. But you you are good, though, aren't you? I'll, I'll, yeah, yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah, you know you are. Yeah. Positive mind. Se secretly. Secretly, the secret mathematician. Okay, right, that's about eight and a half minutes on YouTube. A last plea from me, and very important to us, if you wish to receive newsletters or uh, we can send text messages out, we've got quite a lot of email addresses and mobile phone numbers, obviously. If parents wish to us to develop that and send out e-communications, e please can you contact us with your email and your uh, text message, uh, text number please. And again, this is a contact coming across the top here of who to send that to. So we'll finish today, I think, by saying in, t in the last minute of this, we'll we'll say happy Christmas to the people in YouTube. After one, two, three, we'll go happy Christmas and thumbs up. Everyone ready for it? One, two, three, happy, happy Christmas. Christmas.